Have you ever wondered what your fat stores are telling you or why you have fat in certain places but not others? Well, this video is for you and we're going to go through those different fat deposition spots on the body, what they may mean, but more importantly, four tips to lose weight that you haven't heard. So let me just go and grab my fat right over here because I call him Mr. Fat, I don't know why I do that. But this fat accumulation, if it's happening in certain places, it can be related to what's going on with your hormones. So if you're getting a lot of fat ladies around your bra strap, so in this little area here, maybe around the back as well, this can be related to your thyroid under functioning. So hypothyroid and that low thyroid function. It could mean that your estrogen levels are a little bit high as well. Now, if you're getting it around those love handles so that fat is spilling over your pants over your jeans that muffin top this can be related to your insulin levels and insulin resistance now what happens often first is something called leptin resistance and if you don't know what that is please check out my other videos all about leptin resistance and why it's so important that you are fixing that leptin resistance as that's related to that insulin resistance as well as well as that dreaded belly fat so if you have that extra fat accumulation around the midsection in men and in women as well this can be related to your stress of course and your cortisol levels and this is something that often happens because of leptin levels being out of sync first but something called pregnenolone steel in which in that time of stress your body will preferentially make more cortisol and deposit more of that belly fat, cause more inflammation in your body. I've got other videos on that, so we'll point you in that direction in just a second. But most importantly, let me put this fat back for a second. There we go. Most importantly, I've got four tips to lose that weight that you probably haven't heard. So tip number one is to fix your hormones. So like I was mentioning, that leptin resistance, really important. Part of that is not just dietary. This means fixing your environment, especially your light environment and those EMFs and things like radiation that are in your environment from all of your electronics, really important in terms of fixing those hormones. Also getting grounded is gonna be really important Important for fixing those hormones as well. And tip number two is to support your thyroid health. This is something that's really important in terms of your overall body metabolism. We know that your thyroid has a lot to do with regulating your, the amount of weight that your body is holding on to. And tip number three is to decrease your stress. So we know that when you're stressed out, you're not going to be able to function optimally and your metabolism will follow suit. I want you to check out my other videos, my Be Still videos on another channel. This is fantastic for you to be able to listen to the binaural beats, which are healing frequencies of music that are going to help you to be able to relax your nervous system and can magically melt off that extra body weight that your body is holding on to. And tip number four is improve those sleep patterns. We know that having healthy circadian rhythms is going to be a great way to be able to be in tune with nature, being able to maximize the proper metabolism of your macronutrients, your carbs, your fats, and your protein throughout the day because you're in line with nature and when you're supposed to have that proper metabolism as the light cycle will dictate that. For more tips on how to reverse your leptin resistance, please check out my video, Nine Tips to Reverse Leptin Resistance. I'll see you there.